فاسألوا أهل الذكر إن كنتم لا تعلمون السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته بسم الله والحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على حبيبنا رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم In Surah Al-Shura, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَيَمْحُ اللَّهُ الْبَاطِلَةِ Allah completely eliminates and wipes out falsehood. The focus here is on the verb يَمْحُ. It comes from the past tense verb مَحَا, which means to eliminate or wipe out. And when the verb is written in the present tense, it is spelled يَا ميم ح and wow. But for no grammatical reason here in this verse, the wow has been omitted. And this leads us to believe that there is a rhetorical benefit behind that omission. The context here is a law eliminating and wiping out falsehood. So now why is this wow omitted? It's omitted because Allah Azza wa Jal is conveying to us that when He decides a matter, when He decides to get rid of falsehood, He does it in such a quick and fast and easy, effortless manner that it's executed right away. And the shortening of this verb is like the shortening of the time it takes for this to happen. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala decides a matter. He says be and it is. And this is all conveyed in the omission of this wow. Subhanallah. The less time it takes to recite the word, the less time it takes for the execution of the action. Allahu Akbar. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows best. Wassalamu alaikum. ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته